Are you ready? It's sing-along time. said let there be light and there was light he said let's call this brightness day and the dark will call it night good idea, good on idea. the second day god made the waters divide both low and high he called the water below a sea and above he named it sky and it's the limit yeah. mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. god created the world mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. god created the world on the third day god gathered the land and he called it earth he said, let it bring forth all kinds of plants. They started growing right out of the dirt. Started growing. On the fourth day, God thought there needs to be lights in the night so that we can see. It's so dark in so here. So he shaped the moon and the millions of stars to mark the days, months, years, and the seasons. Twinkle, twinkle. Mm -hmm. And all the birds that fly They travel to the bottom of the ocean deep And the top of the mountain high And on the sixth day God filled all of the land With the animals he had in mind And last but not least for God's final feet He gathered clay and he made humankind Hello. Possible to do, but God made something out of nothing. God made the world and me and you. My name is Dewan, and I'm so excited to see you. Today, we're talking about God's creation. And our big idea today is God created a very good world. My friends and I wanted to celebrate God's creation, so we decided to make some fun things out of wax. Do you want to take a look at them with me? So I made the tree. There's a tree and a sun. And my friend Christian made this. 
Do you know what this is? It's a spider. But wait, Christian, a spider has eight legs, not six. <laughs> uh, what else do we have? <gasps> There's a fish. That's really cute. And our friend Willem, he made a flamingo. <gasps> oh, I just love the flamingo's legs. Can you think of some things that God created that we see during the day? Hmm. So we see the flamingos during the day. We see trees during the day. We see flowers during the day. What about during the night? I'm gonna make a moon. Okay, there's the moon. What else did God make at night? Stars. We have stars. That's fun. You can create some fun art at home to celebrate God's creation too. Let's go to story time. Story time. Hi friends, I'm Dan and today we're reading from the Tiny Truths Illustrated Bible. And we're gonna read about the story to start all stories. Today we're learning about creation. This is where it all starts, the very beginning. At the beginning of everything, there was nothing except God. And God was full of love, full of joy, bursting with happiness and excitement and life. In fact, there was so much love and joy in God that he wanted to share it. So God spoke into the nothingness and something amazing happened. Let's start with some light, God said, and light appeared. Sky goes up here and oceans below. God pulled up land from the water to make tall mountains and deep valleys. And he covered them with plants and trees. You are the sun, he said to the big light, placing it in the sky. You'll light the day. You are the moon, he said to a smaller light. You'll be our night light. Oh, and stars too, he said, and threw tiny lights across the dark sky. God smiled. Beautiful, he said, and it was. He filled the air with singing, flapping birds, and all sorts of things that fly. He filled the seas with splashing, leaping fish, and all sorts of things that swim. On land, he put all kinds of animals, from the wonderfully small to the magnificently tall. Everything was bursting with life, and everything was just as it was made to be. Now for the best part of it all, said God. And he made a man and a woman to live with him in his perfect, beautiful world. They would be his, made to love him and be loved by him forever. You are my children, he said, and all of this is for you. Then God stopped to look at everything he had made. It was so good. He smiled again and then he rested. The great story had begun. Wow, what an awesome story. It's one of my favorites. You guys are gonna head off to activity time, but I'll see you next time. Activity time! Whoa. 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 Hi friends. Isn't it awesome how God created everything in this world? I wonder if he simply thought of something and then it appeared, or if he took some time planning and then created it. Well, whatever it was, God is so creative that he created all the sea creatures, land animals, birds, and flowers. Yeah. I just, can you imagine just thinking of something and then pew, it appears? <laughs> like, that's crazy. I have an idea. Why don't we ask our friends who create the pictures for story time to create us a picture? That is a great idea. Okay, friends, first we need a big screen. So let's make some room. Okay. <gasps> Okay, wow. it's here. I'm excited. Let's first add some sheep. <gasps> yes. Oh, oh they're so sheep. cute. Okay, next, what do sheep want? Right, good idea. They want some grass and they would like some water. Let's add that. Wow, wow that's perfect. Let's add some trees. <gasps> good idea. And some clouds. Oh, yes, I love that. Wow, wow. this is pretty. Okay, now. I want to add my favorite animal, bunnies and puppies. Let's Ooh. add that. Oh, 
They're so, so cute. cute. <laughs> I love our picture. I do too. You know, I think God had so much fun creating everything. And the best part is that he created everything to be good. I had so much fun creating a picture with you, friends. Let's head to Kiever's time. Kiever's. Are you ready to learn the key verse with me? Okay, it goes like this. God saw everything he had made and it was very good. Genesis 1 verse 31. Okay, let's do it together and let's put actions to it so we can remember. All right, God. For God, how about we point up to the sky? God saw. Let's put our hands in circles and make binoculars and put them to our eyes. Saw. Mm, everything he had made. And it was very good. Let's do two thumbs up. And it was very good. Did you get it? And then Genesis 1 verse 31. Let's try it again. God saw everything he had made, and it was very good. Genesis 1, verse 31. That was great. Do you want to do it again? Okay, do it with me. God saw everything he had made, and it was very good. Genesis 1, verse 31. That was awesome. Do you think you can teach it to someone this week? That would be good. Very good. Prayer time. It's almost time to say goodbye. But before we do, may I pray with you? It is always so nice to bless and encourage each other. How about today we put our hands up? blessing hands so that we can bless and encourage each other while we pray. And let's close our eyes. Can you close your eyes with me? No peeking, close your eyes. <laughs> okay, are you ready? Let's pray. Dear Lord, thank you so much for your creation and everything in it. And please help us to take really good care of it so that everyone can enjoy your wonderful creation. In Jesus' name we pray, amen. I had so much fun with you today, and I look forward to seeing you again next time. Bye-bye.